successful homestand and they'll try to cap it off with the cherry tonight. Welcome back to EA Sports. Oh, this building's electric and both teams are set to go. The Ducks will start with the puck as they win the opening faceoff here. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Quick feed to Forsberg. And now he moves it quickly to Yossi. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Stamkos. Oh, big time use of physicality on that one. He knew exactly what he was doing with that hit this early in the game. He's trying to send a message and dictate the pace. And things starting to ramp up a little bit now on the ice with that play. Shuts him down. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We're still scoreless. Anaheim's got it in the defensive zone. With some open space at center. Takes a shot. Oh, pokes it away. Gutsy move, but it pays off. I love the shiftiness to his game. He reads the pace of play, and he can manipulate his own speed. It's not always 100 miles an hour, but it gets the job done. And this time, he gets the shot off. Oh, the save of the play. What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. I really want to look at this last save again, James, because this is about taking it to the next level. When you have this level of competitiveness, athleticism, and desperation and urgency in your game, you know that goaltending coach, they can't just teach this. This is instinctual, and this is what winners are made of. Takes a shot. He scores! And a great start for the home team here. Well, there's an old quote. Chance favors the prepared mind. And I'm telling you, James, it just looked like they were ready for puck drop. And a quick strike gets the fans a blaring. I love the way he gets the position here, James. It makes himself available to get a stick on that shot. I mean, to redirect and deflect that puck, it's not easy. Sometimes your body's taken, but when your hands are free and your stick's free, that can happen. Anaheim's talked a lot about getting off to good starts, and look at this, case in point right here. Well, yeah, you get up by one goal early in the game, and it just creates momentum all around your bench. Everyone gets on the ice. They want to contribute. They want to be the one to get the goal on the board and continue to increase this lead. I think they've been real effective to start this game. Puck scooped up by Nyquist. Takes it into the slot. Gets a glove on it to make the save. Time left in this period. The Ducks have taken a 1-0 lead. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Into the offensive zone down the right wing. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. The Predators take possession in the defensive end. Nashville's got a hold of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Fisher. Oh, and it gets in front of that to make a great save. Chris has been a reason why his team's in the win column. I mean, he's done everything he could between the pipes, as indicated by that save right there. Every time he's between the pipes, he gives his team an opportunity. Takes the feed. Here's a shot. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point-blank range. Goaltender spent so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. Nashville's got the puck in the defensive end. Poked away in the neutral zone by Darlene. Avoids the all alone. Makes the save. Oh, and this is a great save. You can see this one-on-one -on -one battle. And the goaltender is so dialed in, tracking and makes that save. And he gives it over to Power. Pushes it across to Nash. Nashville's got the puck along the wall. Forsberg's got it in the defensive end. On the attack along the boards. Huge steal in his own end. Passes 
Sends it over to Boldy. Sends the feet in front. And that carries off a twig in front of the net. And he takes the feed. Oh, and some lost momentum as the puck leaves the zone. And he sends it across to Richards. And he slides it quickly to Silverberg. Takes it off, but he's still got the puck. Puck not loose in the neutral zone. The Ducks gain possession. Quick pass to Richards. And he makes the save. Silverberg's been feeling it, James. He got the go-ahead goal, and now the puck's on his stick. Here's a short pass to Enroth. Hammers it from the point. Denies him. He got all of it. Puck grabbed by Silverberg. Another stop by the goaltender. The Ducks gain possession along the wall. Moves it to O'Reilly. Avoids the puck check. O'Reilly's been whacked on the play. The official's arm is up in the air. Well, the bench doesn't like this call, James. It's untimely to say the least with that one goal lead. Now the PK unit, they got to get out there and they got to do a job. kill of the night for this team and they won't let that knock their confidence we know their penalty kill unit is ranked toward the bottom of the league it's something they've been actively working on to improve so let's see if any of their improvements show up tonight puck exits the zone now a quick pass to stamkos anaheim's got the puck shorthanded good heads up play in the defensive zone puck slid down the ice Quick pass over to Forsberg. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Quick pass across to Forsberg. Nashville's moving it into the offensive end. Taken along the wall by Fabro. Anaheim's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Sends it quickly to Forsberg. And it's a quick pass to Fabro. Moves the puck. Sends it in deep. The Ducks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Puck cleared from the defensive end. The Predators gain possession in their own end. Dished on over to O'Reilly. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Cutting to the slot. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Silverberg's playing with such confidence right now, and he's got this point streak going. And when that's happening for you, you're having a ton of fun putting up the points. Richard's hoping for some puck luck here on this face-off as they continue to play shorthanded. And he slides it quickly to Marcheseau. Oh, and he has the answer there with a fantastic stop. And now he moves it quickly to Yossi. Over. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. My goodness, they are really starting to dial up the pressure here now. And look at this tremendous puck movement here. The return feed. And some physicality here. Looking to clear from the road end. And they get it out off the glass. Great pass from off the right side. Jocelyn for the puck and it's knocked away. The Ducks are back to even strength here. Specialty teams are critical, especially when you're down by a goal and you have an opportunity to get the equalizer, and they just weren't able to generate anything on that one. And that's a tough one to take as they remain down by a goal at even strength. Scooped up along the wall by Darlene. He carries the puck up along the wing. From the point, looks to make something happen. Here's the breakaway. What a save by the Tendi there. Well, he's exuding a ton of confidence, not sitting back in his neck, challenges and make the save. Feeds it on over to Shea. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. And now he moves it to Smith. And he takes the feed. We're gonna face off after the puck stays covered up. Here in the late going of the frame, Anna hypes up one zip. The face off, they take the puck. And he slides it quickly to Niskanen. 
Takes the pass. He knows he's only one goal away from his next milestone. That's why he's possessing the puck tonight. Quick feed to a Bertolista. The Ducks have a hold of it in the defensive zone. And now he tries to get it across to Nash. A great read on the play. How did he stop that one? He reads this play perfectly, James. He gets tight to the shooter. There's no room to put it by him. Nashville's looking to break out. The Ducks scoop it up along the boards. Into the corner now. Moves it quickly over to Nash. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Nashville's working hard in all areas He's of the ice. Step. Here's a chance in front. And that's stopped. Niskanen's got it deep in the offensive end. Score! James, the recognition of the net front presence in screen, and the goalie drops to the butterfly position, really tries to make himself as big as possible, hoping that the puck just hits him because he can't see it. And the centers glide towards the dot here as we got a face-off set to go. The Predators win it. Looks to pass it to Marcheseau. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. And that'll put a bow on the first 20 minutes of action here tonight. We've got lots more still to come. Second period is just around the corner. Fans, don't forget to enter tonight for our team's side poster, which will give away before the end of tonight's game. about set to go. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up through the first 20 minutes? Anaheim's coaches will be loving that first period, James. I mean, it was a real impressive start. You can't script it any better than that. You dominated possession time. You executed, so it translated into offense. Now they got to find a way to keep it the same, push through the second, and try and put in a full 60 minutes. got possession of the puck. On the redirect. Great save by the goaltender to get a pat on that one. Keeping the puck out of the net. The Ducks gain control of the puck. Anaheim's moving it along the wing. Feeds it down low. Passes it over. And he says no. The Ducks have it against the wall. Made the stop on the play. Well, he's got an uncanny knack to find open space and drive to the net, James. It's because of his slippery hands. When he gets in, he typically finds the back of the net, but not this time. Goaltender read him all the way. Now a quick pass to Niskanen. Wrist shot from the slot. Oh, he stops him with the glove. Great reflexes there. Face off coming up here, and Cheryl, let's see if they can keep that momentum going. No question about it, James. We know where the momentum lies right now after some sustained pressure, heavy pressure, heavy forecheck. Lots of shots going to the net. The goaltender is fatigued. You want to make sure that you can continue to apply that pressure and see if you can sweep one by. The goaltender, they have to have talent, they have to have mobility, and they have to be able to track the puck, but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot, and that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. We're still in the early stages of this period. Anaheim's got a 2 nothing lead. The Predators win the draw on their own end. Inside the offensive end, now down the left. Shot right in front. Oh, a clutch save. Centering pass, and that's intercepted. Looking to set up offensively. 
A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. Niskanen's such a great player, James. He's got great hands and in-tight skill, but just that extra move there, it's a tricky one, and he gets lost in it. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Receives the pass. Nice save from point-blank range. This is a fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving, a reason why he can get square to it and make the save. Takes the feed at the point. Big hit. Quick pass to Enroth. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Jankowski. Knocked away with the stick by Johns. Moves it around along the half wall. And he takes the dish. The Predators cross the line and gain the zone. Evangelista's got it along the boards. Takes a wrist shot. Oh, just got a piece of that one with the glove to keep it out. And it's a quick pass to Johns. Tried to make a move and the puck hops away. Trying to nip the move when you have good hands. Sometimes it works, sometimes you get denied, and that's what happened there. And he was ready for that save. have a decided edge in the shot department and also in the score as well here in the second. And they win the offensive zone face off. Now let's see if they can capitalize. Sissons stick him close and that's so frustrating but he grabs another and he gets back engaging in the play. Fires it into the offensive zone. Anaheim's got the puck. The Ducks get a hold of the puck in their own end. And some good footwork to kick it away. And he slides it quickly to Silverberg. Here they come up along the wing. Nashville's looking to break out of their own end. Here's a short pass to Smith. Gaining momentum up along the side. Dumps it into the Ozone. And the puck goes off that debris on the ice. Anaheim's ready to go on the attack. Right on the doorstep. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Well, this has become the hottest ticket in town. Literally another sellout. What can you say? This is an ongoing theme now, Cheryl. It's an ongoing theme because they're on a roll when you're playing well and it's a lot of fun to watch. People want to be in the building to see your next W. Gains the zone through center. All smart heads up play to poke that one away. From behind his own cage, he grabs the puck. The Ducks take it across the line. Here's a shot. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps him at bay. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Shot. Oh, what a save. He blocked that one. Past the midway mark of the frame, Anaheim's got some breathing room as they lead it 2-0. Stamkos wins the faceoff in the offensive zone. And that goes off a player. And now he moves it quickly to Shea. That one misses and will play on. Well, you spend so much time trying to create scoring chances, and when you do, you've got to find the back of the net. At the very least, hit it, James. Picked up along the wall by Russell. The Ducks will play it in their own end. Jostles for the puck, but still hangs on. Moves it to Marcheseau. Tosses it on to Stamkos. Levels him with the hit. Well, this is what you get when you touch the forbidden fruit. Well, oh, this is about protecting your stars. I mean, you want to make sure that they're taken care of and dropping the gloves here is a clear message that you're not going to have a way with our best players.
can see that they're still out of breath after that duo, that back and forth action. And they'll just sit for five minutes, get some much needed rest. It's fighting, it can be exhausting. And after that tilt, looks like cooler heads have finally prevailed and we're ready to drop the puck once again. Anaheim's won the faceoff at center. The Ducks pick up steam and are on the attack. Slides it diagonally to Novak. Great reach with the poke check. Nashville's got possession here in the neutral zone. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Beautiful read in the defensive end by O'Reilly. Shot! And that one's turned away. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Anaheim's offense has been in full effect tonight as they continue to lead late in this second period. The Ducks come up with a defensive zone draw. Quick feed to Michael. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Grabbed along the board by Faber. And less than a minute to go here in the middle frame. Can't hang on after that hit. Gets the puck over to Carrier. Scrum ensues along the boards. And now he passes up to Evangelista. Feeds it to Johns. You've been thunderstruck. Yeah, and you can see and feel that coming, couldn't you, James? Oh, big save just as time runs out. Well, there you go, 40 minutes in the books. All right, friends, go grab yourself some water, get hydrated, and then buckle up because we've got an exciting third period coming up in moments. The Ducks 
have looked sharp tonight. Lots of pucks on net and a lot of goals as a result. Sissons wins the draw inside his defensive zone. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Keeps possession on the play. Big time stop there. As a goaltender, you want to make yourself as big as possible, and that's exactly what he does right there and just takes away the net. shift where they attack and have the mindset to drive the net. Let's see if it's sustainable now. The Predators haven't had a lot of things go their way tonight, but they finally got a positive here in the third. They're going to have to outnumber their opponent if they want to claw back from this two-goal deficit. They're running out of runway. They're going to find a way to get some chances. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Beat the goaltender, but could beat the post. Anaheim's continuing to push the pace of play in this game. They've been aggressive in the offensive zone. They do have the lead, but they wanted the extra cushion there, but unfortunately went off the post and out. The Ducks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Now a quick pass to Power. Broken up by Carrier. Fishes it off! The goaltenders can't make the save if they can't get in front of the puck, James, so he anticipates this so well. But it's also skating. That power push cross crease makes the save. Anaheim's attempt to put more pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. The Ducks take possession off the faceoff. Big stick save by the goaltender. And they continue to apply pressure here. Angles it over to Forster. Up the neutral zone now. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Moves the pass in front. Moves it again. And that's intercepted. Forsberg's across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. And now he passes it to Silverberg. And that's poked away. Feeds it over. And that's a great heads up play by Yossi. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Forsberg's known for his creativity and he tries one too many moves there and he loses the puck. Oh, nice stop with the glove by Seros. Seattle's coming up next on the schedule, and these two teams, doesn't matter where they are in the schedule, where they are in the standings, always a good contest. I'm looking forward to that. Anaheim's won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. The Predators gain possession along the wall. Gaining momentum along the way. Jostles the puck loose. Champions got it in the offensive zone. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. The Ducks gain control of the puck against the wall. And that's off a stick. The Ducks will play it from the defensive zone. Picks up the puck. And the puck's booted away. Tries to feed it over to Evangelista. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Sent into the offensive zone. Nashville's got it behind the net. Sets it out front. And he denies that great opportunity there. Scoops up the puck in front of the net, trying to clear the zone. But I like this play, James. When you're leading late in the game, you make good blue line decisions. That's what we used to call them anyway. And you put the puck in deep and you just... Open out of the play! Wow! Oh, that's a true competitor's save. Just when you think that he's completely out of it, James, he comes across save to keep his team alive. And he handles the cross-ice pass. Nashville's ready to go on the attack. Great heads-up play in the neutral zone by Brink. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Takes the feed. Quick pass to Power. Quick shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. 
Well, this save was way more difficult than it looked, James. I mean, there's so much traffic in front that he's fighting through to see, and he finds the puck to make the save. Here's a short pass to Fabro. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. The Predators have it from the corner. And it's a quick pass to Silverberg. Along the half wall with the puck. Quick feed down low. And he slides it quickly for power. Back to the blue line. Anaheim's working around along the line. Works it across to Boldy. Oh, tried to put it in the corner and just missed. Well, there's a fine line between scoring and missing, and that's inches right there. A good release shot, but unable to get that net. The Ducks scoop it up along the boards. Take it along the wall by Power. And now he moves it quickly to tip it. Towards the gaping net. Too much congestion in front. Picked up along the boards by Marchessault. Feeds the puck over to Lozog. And as the final seconds tick off the clock, the home fans acknowledging what they just saw tonight.